dear friends this is my tutorial 7 and uh, wasp so in this video i'm going to tell you how to perform electron density in wasp and analysis by vesta so in for this i'm using wasp kit and vesta to analyze the, the electron density so this is the graphene 16 to 6 uh, um, super cell structures so i'm going to show you how to plot electron density of uh, this one so this is the already I calculated this I will tell you how to plot with a Vesta 2D electron density plot so now I will tell you the step by step uh, method to do um, electron density calculation using VASP first to do geometry optimization with a spin 2 and corresponding magma tag second do single point energy calculation using the optimized structure with the same magma tag don't change anything then you will get the charge curve file so uh, from this one we can use wasp kit tool to get the total charge density file this is very important file so then we can use this uh, total density file using a vesta to plot the 2d structure of electron density of the graphene structure So now I will show you the input output files uh, uh, for this calculation what I used. So first you, you need to this is the um, pure graphene 16 to 6 uh, so, 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 uh, supercell input file. So this is the in core file. I already told them my pre previous videos how to how to make the in, in core files for optimization and this is the k point file i use, used for this calculation this is the postcard file so only the carbon only is there only the c and 72 atom present in the molecule this is the postcard file for the corresponding uh, atom this is the script file for uh, job submission so you you um, that's all. you can submit this uh, calculation for optimization then uh, do for uh, single point energy calculation in order to get a charge curve file so so this is the optimized uh, file for uh, pure graphene 6 into 6 uh, supercell so you, you can see here um, best log file So showing the reach required accuracy stopping structural energy minimization if you found this kind of uh, terminology into your uh, best block file so that means the calculation is completed so if, if you want to do the single point calculation so this is the concord file this is the optimized geometry of your system so you can change this concord to postcard do SEF calculations So this is the my input file for SEF calculations. I already I made it. So this is I converted from the optimized concord to uh, postcard. So this is the in-core file for uh, SEF calculation. So I mentioned uh, I already told you you need to keep Ibron minus one and also NSW zero and also L wave and L charge into true. This is very important. Then only you will get the charge curve file okay uh, other things are uh, same or uh, what i use report car and k point and submission script file after submission you will get uh, after some submission you will get this um, so then you can submit this calculation to get a charge car file So I, I actually already completed that uh, optimization so I already completed the geometry optimization and also SEF calculation so I will tell you how to get the charge, charge density file using a VASP kit 
so you can uh, copy this uh, path uh, corresponding path go to here script uh, excel go to corresponding directory then enter so now you can type wasp kit now you will see the different things so you uh, we want to see the uh, charge density analysis so you type 31 from here you can see the different kind of things so what we want here we want the total charge density that means 311 type 311 and enter please wait a few uh, one or two minutes so our uh, uh, our ta task is finished so return the charge west file so this is the way uh, Im important file to plot the charge density so then go here go corresponding folder so re refresh it and you will found the, uh, the charge west file so uh, actually I already downloaded this uh, charge was file earlier so we can use this uh, file to uh, get the charge density so for that just open our, our Vesta so just drag your uh, charge was file so it takes some time to load so that's all we did this is the three dimensional uh, charge density plot of this one so I think we want to plot 2D so for that uh, what we have to do so keep exact position same this, this, this position so just select all the atom then go to utilities here 2d display is there just click it so pop up one more uh, one more page so here you can see slice just click slice you can see this here so here you calculate the best plane for your selected at just click this and press ok then your charge density uh, plot is here so here I am going to tell you some important things so here if you see this the blue colored one is the low electron density no electron density is relatively electron density the red colored one is the strong electron density that means this is a bond between two carbon atoms so here you can if you want to remove this uh, the border line of black color just you click bird view then you that will disappear okay that's all it disappear if you want to change different uh, formal uh, colors so you, this is blue green red so if you want to red green blue so it automatically it, it will revert uh, so center part will come red this part will green so if you want you can also cmy whatever you want omk so basically you can use bgr this is uh, i think good then one more things so go contour here contour uh, you can see here draw contour lines so i think many paper they will uh, mention like this so if you want uh, if you want linear you can uh, keep linear if you want to log the mic so you can uh, use change it if you want to like this so whatever you you like you can use a linear if you want you can use a linear one so that's all so here the saturation level is important for this system the saturation level is, is okay that's why I could not change if you want to change you can also change these values so now we can export this image go to file export 
raster image so if you have this charge charge density image so you can save then pop up here if you, you give some six or nine gate then only you will get the good quality picture so click ok so your graphics file successfully saved then click ok that's all we will go and see our uh, charge density file this is the our charge density file just you want crop so that's all so one more things I going to tell you so this is the paper uh, they also reported uh, uh, charge density so I'm going to show you that so this is the, that paper they mentioned here this is the pure graphene so what we got uh, similarly they also the similarly they also got so that's it we have given the line but they did not um, put the line that's all so thank you for watching so i will give i will give you the um, this input output files in the de description box so please uh, use the link to download and uh, use it so please uh, i kindly request you to please uh, like and uh, subscribe my channel and uh, comment and uh, share to your friends if you like my content it's useful thank you for watching thank you